Anti-aging drug prolongs life, but only one sex. Finding a cure for old age is a cherished dream of mankind. But it may well turn out that for men and women they will have to be developed separately. In any case, one of the most promising anti-aging drugs, rapamycin, had different effects on males and female drosophila. Prolonging the lives of some and not affecting others. Life expectancy for women is noticeably higher than for men. For example, in Russia, according to Rostat, women on average live 10 years longer than men. However, in every barrel of honey there is a fly in the ointment. In old age, women more often than men suffer from age-related diseases and adverse reactions to the medications taken. Thus, the long-term goal of the researchers is to ensure that men live as long as women, and women in old age are as healthy as men. But to do this, scientists need to understand where the differences in the intersex mechanisms of aging come from. Scientists from the Max Planck Institute for the Biology of Aging, Germany, and University College London, UK, studied the effects of rapamycin, a promising anti-aging drug, on male and female drosophila. Rapamycin is known to slow cell growth and suppress immune system activity, which is used in cancer treatment and internal organ transplantation. It turned out that drosophila, who were fed rapamycin, slowed down age-related intestinal pathologies and increased life expectancy by almost two weeks. A long time for creatures that live an average of two to three months. However, this effect was observed only in female flies. Male drosophila, both receiving rapamycin and sitting on a control diet, lived equally long by the way, somewhat less control females. Scientists have linked the results of the study to increased autophagy. The process of removing cellular waste, in the guts of females treated with rapamycin. In males, the level of autophagy is initially higher, so the effect of the drug did not improve the condition of their intestines. Similar results were obtained on laboratory mice, which phylogenetically are already much closer to humans than drosophila. In other words, if rapamycin is still used as an anti-aging drug for people, most likely, only women will find a positive effect, while it will not help men. Stay tuned for more updates.